Welcome to Algebra 114. I am Michelle Benson Young, your class instructor. This is a short video, just a few minutes long, to go over um, what class is going to be like and to get to know me and, and a little bit better. So, um, our office hour, my office hours are Tuesdays and Thursdays from 11 to 12:30. That's my email address and my phone number. Feel free to call and or email and leave messages anytime. I'm also on Twitter and Skype. And I'm very excited to be the instructor of this class and see all of you. For student resources, I just wanted you to know that this is the building that my office is in, and it's the same one as the tutoring lab, Pearson Room 33. So in addition to what you'll get during class time, you will be able to use the student lab. I'm going to have a student study guide available, and we'll go over that through class, and as well as my office hours. I want to make sure that we can accompany all learning styles and accommodations in this class. So the more you know um, your own learning styles and can communicate that with me, I think the more successful you're going to be. And, and I would like every one of you to be very successful. The goal of this course is to give you the algebraic foundation necessary to continue on in mathematics courses. So we'll be going over things like algebraic notation, properties of equations, problem solving techniques, and algebraic vocabulary. Our course objectives is first off to do um, well in this course. And then again, we also want you to um, understand algebra techniques and properties, families of functions, mathematical notation and vocabulary, as well as and what I think is the most important is reflective thinking. And these will all be connected to the daily assignment. So the materials in class, first off is the textbook. And that's available at the store, um, the student store. It's an accessible format in, the, in this text can, it does exist and can be assessed, accessed through the Office of Disability. We will have a course website and that's going to have a lot of additional information as well as more videos from me explaining things in depth or in a different way that I may have done in class. We will have slide presentations. I will also load those up onto the course website. Um, there will be related websites that I think are going to be very helpful and hopefully you will be able to show us and share with the class related websites that you found to be helpful in understanding the material. And that's part of the student contributions as well as your thinking. Um, the assignments and assessments are always some, you know, the most stressful part. So the assignments, you know, that little black box there, um, there's weekly homework activities as well as in-class activities and small group work. The assessments are, there's a few different types. There's open book quizzes four times during the semester. There are three problem solving projects, as well as a midterm and final exam. So the midterm and final exam, you know, as you can see by the diagram or the image here, have constitute 50%. And then the problem solving projects and the quizzes are each 25 to make up a whole of 100. So timing and scheduling. Once again, we have class Tuesdays and Thursdays, 8 to 10, 15. There is homework due on Thursdays, and there's homework feedback on Tuesdays. And there are also in-class assignments that are due by the end of class. Now, I realize this is an early class, so make sure that um, Monday and Wednesday nights are good nights for you. <laughs> Stay hydrated. Math is fun. Um, we're also going to have quizzes. These are the dates of the quizzes. So you can plan in advance the dates of the project. And then, of course, we have our midterm and final. Check the learning guide for details on how that's going to look. And last but not least, student expectations and responsibilities come to every class. Be on time and be present, meaning have your coffee or your breakfast. And you're, you're, you're welcome to bring it with you, but make sure that you're ready to go. Take advantage of all the course material. Um, I want each one of you to be successful. I want all of your learning styles to be honored and accommodated. And so that is what all the class material is about. And then communicate. Make sure that you let me know what's going on, if there's something that more I can support you with, if there's something that I need to know to improve myself as a teacher, I would like to hear that too. So thanks again and welcome. <laughs>